Hello and welcome back. This is week three of our Premier League predictions. I am joined by Scaife and Tobias. Hello. Hello. I'm getting my stream up now. They're about to see what's happened. Three, two, one, bang. Look how many reds I've got there. Shit. <laughs> have, you, Shit. have you rigged that? Is that actually what I said? I swear on my life, this is, I've gone through everything afterwards and got the results. Scaife got five points, Toby got six, and I got ten, bro. And at both your points, you got an extra one for Salah and Havertz. I've been scammed again. Yeah, that Havertz. Maybe right. correct. Maybe predict the correct score then, pal. Well, I'm looking at total score. Scaife and Toby are on 12 and Callum's on 15. So you can watch your tone right now, young man. Because I am walking this league. And I'll this is only this two bit. weeks in. All right, good. Be better. Going Quality straight. will go up. Engagement through the How roof. I only had two, like, correct ones. Yeah, like, you know any. what? To be fair, Toby hasn't had any. Toby's shit. Yeah, I just get the results right and the goal scorers right. Yeah, you have been nice with the goal scorer twice. I got two draws right. And everyone laughed at me for Ipswich Villa, by the way. Yeah, Everyone. that's a good one. But to be fair, yeah, Scaife, I want an apology. I want you, I want you to apologise. I watched Everyone, that game, mate. Any, mate, anything. The world could have ended in that game. Anything could have happened. <laughs> which which I didn't even care. Oh, two one Brighton. I couldn't even care. Two less. one Brighton. I want, I want an apology. And West Ham. Well, I thought West Ham were going to win as well, weren't they? Yeah, it's, well, it's, it's, it's early kickoff glitch, glitch, isn't it? George. They need to patch it that kickoff glitch. glitch. George. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Do you, just you know, Brighton rocks up to the Emirates. <laughs> and they, had no, they had no that. problems. They had no problems. So. Well, like yeah, I asked I want, right, I want, at least. I want you to apologise, George. I need to apologise. No. It's exactly, it's exactly what you need to do. That's Just because they didn't predict to fucking fair. Palmer 4, Brighton 2. You only got two results, though. Like, everything else is just wrong. The way like, I see this is, in terms of making this like engaging wrong. as a series, I've got to kind of slip down the list and then go back up later on. You know what I mean? Oh, Redemption right. Out. Engage oh, keep them, one of them keep ones. coming. Oh, right. He's going for the last minute winner. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Saturday the 5th of October 2024, next week's fixtures. We have got Crystal Palace Liverpool to kick us off. Scaife, the scouser that's never been to ground, please tell me what's going to happen. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> oh. No, Palace Thanks, have been shit. <laughs> Palace have been shit. We've been all right, but we had a game yet last night. We played well. Played the exact same 11 pretty much as the, the weekend game, though. I'd like to see players rested, but I'll go 2 1 Liverpool. Oh, yeah, we've got to get fixed. Shit, that's a good. Oh, he's oh, yeah, done well there. We've got to go jump in with the score. Um, yeah. I, I, I know what you mean with Palace. They've had bad results, but I don't think they are that bad. Do you know what I mean? Like, I th still think they'll have an all right season, even if they've started really poorly. Yeah, they drew to you, didn't they? So. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> exactly. Um, I think Liverpool will win. I, no, I don't. No, do you know what? Spirit of Cristambul lives on. 1-1. One, one. Ooh. There you go. That's, That's shocking. That's really bad. It Liverpool is. top at league defensively very good. You think they'll concede yeah, the way but you know they they lost at home to Forest. Like I don't know if I, like Forest. Yeah, lost... That's the only game they've dropped points in. I agree. In any I, comp. Just, I agree. I just I don't know. I just feel like Palace will get off the mark a bit. Yeah, you like, don't know, mate. That bad. Wow. Well, I think defensively Liverpool look a different beast. I'm going. I'm gonna go one nil Liverpool. I love you. I'm gonna go for, <laughs> go for a tidy Liverpool. A tidy Liverpool win. Right, but we oh. To be Toby's gone for a draw there nice and early. Mm. So we've instantly got a point in there, Scaife. That's nice. Yeah. Right. Arsenal, Southampton. 5 0. 2 0, Arsenal. 2 0. I thought you got like 12 0 12 or something there. I'll go, nah. four, I'll go 4 0. I went 4 0 last oh. week against Leicester at home, and they almost managed to bottle that game, the bottlers, but I think they'll get the job done against Southampton, to be honest. To be fair, oh, to, uh, I, re I kind of regret that, and we're doing first answer only, aren't we? Shit. So I was like, maybe it's Russell Martin's job's definitely online here. Maybe he's going to change to try and keep it, but he'd probably rather get sacked and then just walk into a Tottenham job one instead. Yeah, so, yeah, this is what true. What can you do away at Arsenal? What can you do? Well, they're going to try well, and play it out mate, from back Lester, out there. Leicester almost came away with a point. Brian got a point, and we got, they got smashed by us when they tried to play us. So, you know, some of these teams, they have, plan, they have good plans at Arsenal, maybe. If Southampton gets something from there, I will make a public apology to Russell Martin. There's just no that, way. That would be right. mental. Mm. Brentford versus Wolves. Ooh, one one. Some heads to heads on it. Oh, why is this game not on telly? God, what a game! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, I'm going one one. I'm getting majority out at way with two different teams. What are them Boemo scoring in the first minute? Um, Probably. Low key, Gary O'Neill's. I can't really said low key, but yeah, Ooh. Gary O'Neill's job's kind of. It's looking a bit stressful. Had a very hard start. Yeah, they've had tough teams. They're just not winning any games, are they? Um, I'm gonna go Desmond. I like a Desmond. Both controls. Yeah. Ooh, yeah. I, I could Brentford, it. innit? Brentford like a draw. 3-3. Three, three. No, I'm joking. Um, I'll go Wolves 2-1. <laughs> I was impressed by Wolves when they played us. 
I know they're set up a bit differently to everyone else, but they've got a good midfield. Andre, we've mm. seen him play. Oh, my God. He's unbelievable. Sorry, yeah, like who, who was that guy that you've watched once that you said we're going to be like next best thing? Well, that's, Gomez. That's, that's Andre. No, Jao, I like Jao Gomez to be fair. But no, I, he was as well. Right or right. unless it was a, a Brighton player. It's someone that had played like five oh, or six years. Vifa. 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 No, yeah. Vifa. He's injured, yeah. I think. <laughs> yeah. Oh, is he? <laughs> oh, like no. Wolves. You were the next best thing. The most underrated player in the league. Right. Leicester Bournemouth. Oh, another one. Classic. Some shit games here. If this game didn't exist, I would not care. <laughs> um, Do you know what? I'll go two one Leicester. I think they're going to get off the mark. I actually, they they'll probably be. They'll, I don't ta- mind they'll that. take some courage from that Arsenal game. I know they're a bit unlucky, but like James Justin, he's going for the golden boot. I fancy them too. Yeah, yeah that were a great goal away at Arsenal. Bournemouth were good though against. But, yeah, Bournemouth were good, but it is Southampton. Yeah, it's tough. I'm going to go two. I'm with one one. Anyway. Ooh. I'm, I'm with another draw. I'm off two on Bournemouth. Bit of a spread there. Oh, we're, c- we're across the board. Yeah. I love all like that. <sighs> they've, to be fair, Leicester have got to get something here. Yeah. If they want to have any sort of chance of staying up, they've got to. Um, next, Man City, Fulham. Ooh. I'm going to take my time with this. Fulham, Fulham have been good. So We've said it every week. That... Yeah, I have as well. Yeah. <laughs> they've, they've <laughs> I've predicted them to get battered every week. <laughs> Yeah, and then last week they went away to Forest. They won. On slot yeah. could learn from Marco yeah. Silva a bit, yeah. maybe. Have, have but... you seen the the chance of winning league for the top six? No. Yeah, I've seen that. Yeah, I think they've they're they're in with a shout. They've got zero percent or something, isn't it? Yeah. Well, City have got like seventy percent chance, and Fulham have got zero point zero zero. So <laughs> this is a real title race, class. This. It actually oh, is. What? Would you be okay? Would you be shocked if Fulham picked something up? I wouldn't. Yeah. Oh. I don't think I'd be like as in I look, but yeah, the probability is that City win. But the way that Fulham have been playing and the way that City currently looked against Newcastle, yeah, completely agree. I Three no City. <laughs> <laughs> Can't see Fulham scoring. I'm gonna go two one City. I think it'll be quite. Oh, I, won't go. I was just gonna say Ooh. that. That's a really good one. Could be actually. I could be a free Fulham scoring. Yeah, same. But it could be like a three one. I'm gonna go with that. I'm gonna. I'm gonna go with three one. I'm I'm gonna put an, uh, Harland in this week as well on FPL. I'm gonna reinstall it because I've had Munk on the last couple of weeks. I'm gonna put Harland in. <laughs> right, so all Man City wins. West Ham Ipswich. switch. Lopetegui, Axe is coming. Mm. Oh, do you know what? I'm going. This, I'm going back to back Desmonds for Ipswich. That's, that's, that's good. I'm gonna I'm gonna go proper out there. I'm saying two one Ipswich. Yeah, I don't mind that. I think yeah. They will really... score oh, though. No. Ipswich defensively the... look a bit. The Villa game were good for Ipswich, but I think you are underrating them, no, overrating them a bit. Yeah, but I think it's more that West Ham have been pants. Yeah. You know? That's true, but if West they don't Ham win this game, pants. what can they win? I got well, two on West Ham. West Ham away is like not. I don't think. West Ham away, even though they've started quite poorly, it's still not the easiest place to go, is it, West Ham? No. That's what I mean, yeah. In general. They've no. two on West Ham. Well, yeah, you've got to be beating the newly promoted teams at home. Yeah, well, they haven't Come won a so. game yet at home, so they're going to be. This is the one then, you know. Yeah, I don't. I don't mind. I don't, I don't mind you going for that. I, I really don't mind you going for that at all. Well, Everton, Newcastle, and they are fiver. Stop putting Newcastle so. on telly, please. Please stop putting them on telly. <laughs> They're so boring. They are. Like, I know Gordon's like a right watch. That's about it. They're on every week. Newcastle. Yeah, They're not even yeah. in Europe. There's no excuse for them to be on TV. I've just had enough of it. I need to get that out there. That said, I think they'll win. Two one. I think Gordon, oh. uh, and I'm taking my goal scorer. I believe in old club syndrome. Anthony Gordon against Everton. Oh, you're taking it now? Mm. Yeah. All right, shit. Yeah, yeah. I'm just taking. I'm taking Gordon just out of pure. It's only just come to me. I don't then, mind that. That like he will score against Everton, and the boos will be so loud, and he'll knee slide maybe. Yeah. I don't think there'll be that many boos because they won at weekend, didn't they? They did, but a, a Gordon goal is going to give you boos anyway, surely. Well, yeah, true. And then he goes to Liverpool in January. Yeah. Even though he signed a new yeah. contract, that'll be like the booest of the boos. I'm really a five. I'm saying a draw, one one. Yeah, <laughs> I might be really cavalier here and go two on Everton. I think in this game you've got to take risks, and I think it could. We we can all see this being an Everton win, can't we? In, in some crazy world, it can happen. Yeah, Maybe. yeah. To I'm, be go- fair, I'm gonna yeah. be. All, I'm gonna fall. Was it dying my sword? Dying my shield? Dying my shield? That's the one. Two on Everton. I think it is dying your sword. No, falling your swords like when you admit defeat, but like. Die on your shield, is that the one? 
Toby, help. I don't think Die on that hill. You did English, didn't you? Fall on your sword, die on that hill. You're taking wisdom in old man Toby. Sorry, so I'll down down (laughs) on the shield, all right? I'll make one up. He's going to die on his shield for some reason. Right. (laughs) Sunday, 6th of October. (laughs) Superb Sunday. I took Tottenham on every week as well. I'm fed up with Tottenham. Yeah, at least they're more entertaining than Newcastle. I'll give them that one, Spuds. Villa Man United. Oh, they've just played, don't they? Villa have just played yeah, and they've beaten Man United Bayern tomorrow, and they today. take on Manchester United. Manchester United play Porto today. Away as oh, well, isn't ooh. it? Yesterday for you guys watching. Oh, God. Villa are winning this. 2-1 they are... Villa, they're a better team. Oh, I'm going... 4-1 Villa. Wow. Oh! No. 4-1 Villa. I reckon. Yo, I don't know about that one. No, no, no. J- Villa. No, I don't even blame be, you. Villa yeah, are going to yeah. be buzzing, and that United team are crap. Villa are better than Spurs, in my opinion. And yeah, they are. I, Villa are going to be buzzing, but they might be knackered from playing yeah, by Munich. Yeah, but United played a day later away in Porto. Porto are no slouches; like they're a decent side. That'll be tough. And that, that t- Ten Hag, that I just can't see a world where Villa don't win that game. Like I, I can't. Yeah. It might not be four one. I might be going a bit over the top there, but I just. I'm sure United fans feel the same probably at this point where they're just they're, they're probably expecting a loss um, in the Villa game really see I like thinking me a bit when I come into this but like then it's thinking. like if, Cheers, if you don't if you don't just see it instantly like <laughs> my 2-1 is gone I want a 2-1 and it's gone do I think they'll score <sighs> I said they were really really bad against Tottenham really bad I'm gonna go no Bruno as well 2-0 oh, no, there isn't he Shit, Villa. rescinded I'm, I'm going 2-0 Villa Villa wins across the board then. I'm going, I'm going for a clean sheet though. Do you reckon this is the last, that'll be the last that we see of him? I hope not. I really hope no. not. No, no, he'll keep going. I don't think he'll ever get sacked. I oh, think he's man. just going to be one of them. I think he's on the cusp. I think he's... You know, like on David Jones' ship when that guy's like stuck to it <laughs> yeah, and he just can't get rid of That is Ten Hag. Yeah, nice. You'll <laughs> never get rid of him ever. Right. Chelsea versus I Forest. you get f***ing beat here. Yeah, well, you've hoped that for a while now, Scaife, and here we are. So, <laughs> <laughs> I can't even um, do you. They're good. They're good. They, they did. They did beat you. I I see a Forest goal as well. I just see more Chelsea ones. So I'm gonna go two one Chelsea. I'll go three two Chelsea. Three yeah, two. Know. Yeah. God, you can't laugh at weird Chelsea score lines. Goals, like, we've got, yeah, just yeah, goals. It's just a weird. It's it's consistent. I'll go one all. <laughs> oh. I love it. I love it. You we need. We need. A, stink, Callum. I would like a table at the end of the season of how many points we ended up in Scaife's world. I reckon. Yeah, yeah you'll go down. Down. Yeah, down. Yeah, I reckon you get relegated yeah. big time. <laughs> to be fair, Forest. No, Forest will be tough. Like they beat Liverpool. They must be a good. Yeah, team. they're a good. They're a good side, but Chelsea's scoring so many goals. Yeah, I just think Forest yeah, will Palmer sit is, back yeah. more. Like Forest, Forest will sit back, and that's a different kind of problem for us. So I think it'll be tight, but I think we'll get the job done. I could see Forrest going one to look though. Yeah. On the counter, they're going to bum you. <laughs> Is that a goal scorer? <laughs> Fuck it. Let's do this. Lock it in. Hudson Adoy. I'm being deadly serious. They scored last year against us, to be fair. Lock me in, Callum. You're going Hudson Adoy. Well, let me think about it, but. Yeah. No, you're, no you've locked no, it in. No, you've locked, it's locked. You've locked if it. This comes it's can, I get double po- can I have double points for it then? No. No. <laughs> oh. Gentleman's agreement. Come on. Give me something here. <laughs> no. What do you, why? Boring, oh my god. It's the, it's the second week. It's the third <laughs> week. What do you mean double points? I think if you pick a rogue player, you get double points. Define rogue. I could sort of die. Yeah, he's lost. Right, last game. Brighton and Spuds. But what did you go? Oh, no, did you go three? You went I went three, three, two. I went three yeah, two yeah, Chelsea, course, yeah. Of course. Brighton Spuds is a tricky old game. Yeah, it is. Two, like a 2-2, two, two I can see here, but I won't go for it. I'll go 2-1 one, one, Tottenham. One. Oh. Defensively, I'll Brighton one, were poor, one. weren't they? Against you, Toby. Yeah, I think if they play like that... I know you like were really that, good, but... I, no, no, I think if they play like that, Spurs will do similar to what we did, to be honest, because Spurs, I think, going forward are, are really good, but I think they'll also let in goals. I think, I, I, do you yeah. know what? Yeah, fuck it. 4-2. I'm going to go another 4-2. Four, 4-2 two, four, two Spurs. Same result as last week for us. Oh, there's some you could hit big here, you know, Toby. Like, in here. Yeah, but imagine Somebody's, if they come yeah. off. Do you know what I mean? If It's like, yeah, you could go for tap-ins, but I'd rather score a 30-yard screamer. If you get the 4-2, yeah. you I'll it. tell you what, speaking Can't of 30-yard screamers, I'm going to take my player and it's going to be John Duran. I'm taking him. I like that. I, think I like that. He's going to come off bench and score a screamer again. He's yeah. an absolute beast. At what point does he start, though? You know what I mean? Oh, I 
if, do you think he tries something with him and Watkins? But I, I think he likes rotating them because of the amount of games that they've got. Like him and Watkins and Rogers have a really nice dynamic as well. It's just mm. Villa have a really nice set of options. Like they have nice problem, yeah, they do. problems. They've got some very different profiles as well. They've got mm. some good players there. Pat squad out well for Europe that they've got. Mm. But that's that. We're done.